Let business be done on Capitol Hill that will address itself to the real issues and not to games. Senate is relaxing its dress code, its informal dress code, which has required members to wear business attire. Yeah, Democrat John Fetterman from Pennsylvania, perhaps unsurprisingly, yeah. he's known for his hoodies and shorts, says he's grateful for the update, but he says he doesn't plan to come to work dressed down too often. Oh, no, the senator from Kentucky. And Susan Collins joked, and I love this, she said, <laughs> I plan to wear a bikini tomorrow. Many visitors, many bus was a group of three appropriation bills, which we were trying to call for consideration and bring up this measure as part of it. The bus was pulled over to the curb this afternoon. We don't know how soon it's going to be back on the road again. So the Appropriations Committee, both the House and Senate, can continue to bring individual bill. Bu 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 this bill also in includes Representative uh, Cusimano, uh, Cus Cusimani's legislation to create a new inter internship program. As the Hiroshi Mahamura VA Clinic. The Hiroshi Maharu Mahamura was born in Gallup, New Mexico, the son of a Japanese immigrant. He received the nickname Hershey from his fourth grade teacher who could not pronounce his first name correctly. I know how that happens. You know, I appreciate Mr. Nagis you know, taking I, my, my wife. Nagus. Oh, I'm from Mr. Nagus. That's all right. Last 15 minutes for a bill that you just say is just singular, useful. not plural. Incisor, <laughs> basically incisor or incisor. Like the tooth? Oh, uh, can you uh, please uh, use it in a sentence? In fact, it is the tooth. When, mask, when Max asked his dentist whether he would need to remove the incisor, Dr. Groucho replied, incisor, I barely know her. <laughs> Rich Richmond? give the words. Oh, all right. All right, try it. Just try it. So. Baton Rouge. B A T T O N R O U G. <laughs> you don't even have to ring the bell. The snort is enough, okay? <laughs> Yeah, how often do you think of the Roman Empire? I would say it three times a week. Really? Yeah. You yeah. think of the Roman Empire three times a week? Yeah. All right, but apart from the sanitation, the medicine, education, wine, public order, irrigation, roads, a fresh water system, and public health, what have the Romans ever done for us? The Republican leadership of this house is incompetent. I mean, they're so incompetent it takes my breath away. They're letting the clowns run the circus. What I can tell you is that climate change is real. We got to do something about it. Yeah, this one's and called been... Autumn, sir. So I'm sorry? This one's called Autumn right now, so yeah. I'm uh, sorry, I couldn't make out what you said, sir. This climate change right now is called Autumn, yes. Yeah, that's, that's the seasons changing, which mm -hmm. respectively is not the same thing as the climate changing. There was a world naked bike ride in Madison, Wisconsin, just a couple months ago, and I sent you a letter two months ago asking if you had a problem with that um, because it exposed a 10-year-old girl by the race organizer, the bike organizers, to pedaling around Madison, Wisconsin naked. Do you think that's a problem? No, it sounds like you're asking about a question about state and local law enforcement. Um... Senator Tuberville's all the military promotion. Okay, answer me one question. Read that sign. Read that sign. To quote Bill Murray's fam uh, character in Groundhog Day, I wake up every day right here, right in Punxsutawney, and it's always February 2nd. Do you ever have deja vu, Mrs. Lancaster? I don't think so, but I could check with the kitchen. 